potential students will come to us and ask us, how do I obtain soldering certification or how do I become certified as a soldering tech? Well, let me explain to you a couple ways that you can do that. So there are basically two paths one can take. The first path has to do with IPC certification. IPC is an industry recognized trade group that has put together a training program, a certification program, whereby students through various training centers, of which we are one of them, train people on the different programs. Now there are a variety of IPC programs. One can get certified in things like wires and terminals, one can get certified in the boards themselves and how to inspect them. But the one that we're talking about typically, or the one the caller is talking about, is the J Standard Program. The J Standard Program is an industry globally recognized certification program whereby assembly techniques are taught, hand soldering assembly techniques are taught. So why would you want to become IPC certified or why would you need IPC certified soldering techs? Basically falls into two different camps. The first of which is your contract says that you shall, you shall use IPC certified soldering techs. So the contract is driving that. The second case is driven by the quality system. Perhaps you've been recently audited and you are required to have an industry recognized or an ANSI approved program for all the critical training elements. Or your ISO program calls for some type of outside training resource or industry standard to be used. So those are the two reasons you would go down that first path that I described. The second path would be one which a training center, like ours, would train you on hand soldering skills. And this would be a specific center recognized certification, valid to that center, recognized probably by a regional scope of employers, but one that would certainly give you a certification. So the answer to the question, typically when asked, how do I get a soldering certification? is the IPCJ standard and that is valid for two years and it belongs to you and is transferable with you as you move from job to job. So hopefully